This motherboard generation, ASUS has had its ups and its many, many, many downs. But for the record, the ASUS Tough Gaming Z790 Plus Wi-Fi, despite its obnoxious name, isn't actually that bad, and both the DDR5 and DDR4 variant can be all yours for just $280, which sure, is far from the cheapest Z790 board, but for what you do get, it's actually fairly reasonable. Starting off with CPU power, here we have 16 plus 1 power phases rated at 60 amps. A fairly standard configuration for the price, and something that's going to be more than enough for most CPUs, even if you're doing some overclocking. But of course, it's ASUS, so it had to do one very, very odd thing to balance the books. Because you know how normally when you have DDR5 and DDR4 variants of motherboards, the only difference is the memory type? Well here, the DDR4 variant only has 8 plus 4 pin power connectors for the CPU, while the DDR5 variant has the two full 8 pins that you would expect from a $280 motherboard. Okay. But why? At least the PCIe expansion makes some more sense, and it's honestly some of the best I've seen on any Z790 motherboard, with a primary PC Gen 5 16x slot, another physical 16x but in practice Gen 4 4x slot, and in addition to that an actual PC 4x slot and two PC 1x slots. That's a lot of slots! And now I've said slots so many times it doesn't really sound like a word anymore, but anyway, this configuration is fantastic, and it means that whatever kind of expansion you're doing, you are gonna have slots to support it, be it capture cards, sound cards, expansion cards of any other type, this motherboard has got you covered. And it doesn't stop there, because this tough Z790 board also comes with four M.2 slots, though sadly none of them are PC Gen 5, which granted isn't that common at mobile boards in this price range, so uh, I will let it slide this time ASUS. In fact, the only real disappointment when it comes to internal expansion is the SATA connectors, seeing how you only have four, while six is pretty much the standard for Z790 boards, especially ones that cost this much. But that's like one single mistake in a sea of fantastic choices that ASUS has made here, so honestly, it's not going to keep me up awake at night. And all the great features don't stop there, because we still have the rear I.O. to cover, and yeah, the six USB Type-A ports that are on offer probably aren't going to blow too many people away, there are motherboards that have more, but the crazy thing is that they're all USB Gen 3 or faster, something you don't see too often. And in addition you get two USB Type-C ports, with one of them rated for 20 gigabit per second speeds. Add to that 2.5 gig Ethernet, Wi-Fi 6C, both integrated HDMI and DisplayPort and a full array of five 3.5mm audio jacks and optical spin-off, and you have pretty much the ideal rear I.O. Again, the 6 USB type A ports may not be enough for some people, but for the rest of us, that's some good rear I.O. That all means that ASUS still know how to make a good motherboard. So that just begs the question, what happened with all the other ones that I've been burning at the stake on this channel? I honestly don't know, and sure you can make the argument that it is still $280, but it's going to be a $280 well spent, so if you want to get it yourself, then make sure to use Amazon links down in the video description below, because that way you don't pay anything extra, while we get some of the money back that gets reinvested straight back into the channel. And while we're still here, make sure check out our Patreon, because even a single dollar month truly goes a long way, while you get awesome perks as well. I'd also like to thank my existing patrons, Gavin Burns, Ryan, Ricky B, Justin Rage, Ella Vroniak, John, Badal Schrauker, Max Sumner, Shane Allcroft, Lance B, Jesse Herbman, and Shannon Odgun. Down there you can find our merch store, our Discord Discord server and our social media links as well. But anyway, that's what it's. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then remember to subscribe, like, whatever, and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye, everyone. Good. Bye.